hey there i am ram and welcome to the next tutorial of java <coughs> which is library management system so let's get started and the today's topic is a uh, new account new account so create a jframe name it sign up and let it finish now we need we need five levels so first is name another one is username and after that is password and thereafter security question and after that is answer and we need four text fields one and two and one three and we need a combo box uh, we need a combo box for the security question and last one is for answer and we need two buttons two buttons one is for create create and another is for back make all the field empty first of all we will add icon to all this so uh, let's so place the icons uh, i have downloaded it from set so now <coughs> go to the property of icon select an icon save icon okay now it's looking better now the back one so we know okay now it's done now we'll add a panel to this and close in sudo so container oops panel and go to the proper <coughs> go to the property title new account and increase the size to 24 then select the color uh, make it green and the border make it uh, skim color and you can increase the thickness of the line border line uh, now it's done okay okay here is our New account form and last one we have not added any <coughs> security question in the field so let's add some go to the model here is the model click the item and here you can add any type of question like i am adding four questions what is your mother tongue and what is your nickname and what is your first 
and last one your school name now okay here four of our question has been added here now our new account page has been done now moving back to connectivity now <coughs> before starting the connectivity we i want to tell you that that connectivity is used for connecting your project and database in <coughs> in everywhere database is all everywhere is database is used so database is very important to our <coughs> ourselves so let's get started so we need a class to code some to add some code in in that where is the java class yeah here is java class name it java connect and finish this here is our java connect has been created now we will put some code in this so right now we are going to start Here try and catch is used for finding errors easily. and um, so let's get started Uh, here we need the address of the address of the database we created so yet not we have created the database so let's create first so go to the go to the Mo uh, mozilla firefox and search for 
SQLite extension uh, I have already downloaded the SQLite manager so you you add you add it, uh, add it to our uh, your Firefox and next it will uh, install install that SQLite manager then then it will show to the customize click the customize add the SQLite manager here so it will be easy to open all time you know so let's create a so here we create a new database click new database name give name to your database like I am giving library new okay now click the okay and where you want to save that database go to your project NetBeans project library management system and here I am saving that, that database select folder now the data data has been, database has been created now in this tutorial we only need the address of the database so close we will do it later now go to the database uh, netbeans now copy the location of that database go to documents where have been saved that go to that and here you copy the database copy now paste in it here now here has here we have pasted and one thing library new dot sqlite and we are done this java class will connect whole whole the <coughs> whole the project with the database uh, that's why we have created this class so thank you keep watching this video and please subscribe if you have any query regarding this project do comment or do email me i have suggested in my email address to the description box thank you bye bye